Okay, as you can see, I'm out here in the driveway today, and we're gonna start with building the baseboard for the switching and shunting layout. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so the first thing I've got to do is I'm going to take and square off the end of this board here. I just picked it up at, uh, at Lowe's uh, Hardware. And so I'll cut that uh, square on one end and then we'll measure off and uh, cut them into two equal four foot sections. And that should get us ready for uh, making the first of the baseboards. So let me go ahead and we'll get started. Okay, so that's got the end squared off, so now I'm going to measure it out into two four-foot sections. Okay, so we got the sides for the first of the baseboards. So I'm going to go ahead and cut the others and I'll check back with you when I'm done. Well at this point I've cut all four of the sideboards so now we're going to proceed to the end pieces here. These will be 22 and a half inches long because these are three quarters of an inch thick. So that's an inch and a half, 22 and a half gives me 24 inches wide. So this will be a two foot, two foot by four foot um, baseboard and we're going to do two of those. Okay, and there we have the four end pieces. So it's all cut. And the next step, cutting a piece of plywood for the top of each one of the baseboards. So for that, I've got to put up this saw and get the other saw out. So we'll get started with that in a minute. Okay, while I've got this saw out, I decided to go ahead and cut some two by two by six inch long corner braces. And these are gonna be temporary corner braces until I decide to install the legs permanently. And that's mainly so I can flip the darn thing up on its side when I want to and leave it down on the sawhorses the rest of the time. So let me go ahead and finish cutting this one off. So now I have four of those for each one of the baseboards. Okay, so the next part of this job is to take this a uh, four by four uh, foot piece of plywood and cut it into two two by four foot sections. So let me go ahead and get these measured out. Uh, it's exactly, you know, four feet across. So I'm gonna cut that into two two foot wide sections. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and start doing some cutting. Okay, so what I'm doing now is these, uh, th this was actually, it wasn't exactly four foot by four foot, it was uh, four foot by 49 inches. So I'm gonna have to cut an inch off of each uh, end of these. Here we go again. Okay, so we now have all of the pieces to go into the baseboard. Now I've just got to put it together. <laughs> 